uh, I'm going to talk about this and the time bank project, the origins. Well, first, Edgar Kahn is the creator of the, of the time bank idea. He, is, he was working in social services for a lot of time, and he wanted to, to improve the, how the, the organizations of social services organizations work. And he noticed, noticed that uh, they work in a de deficit-based approach to social services in which they see people in the terms of their needs in ter instead of the, in terms of the, what they can provide and what can they provide to themselves. So the idea is that uh, everyone can contribute, just like in open source, and this can foster the community. And it's, it's sad that uh, many people didn't, didn't even ask for the chat next door for even a, a bit of, of sugar. <laughs> and so in 1980, uh, he coined, uh, invented the idea of time banking. So what's the, this thing uh, I'm talking about? Well, it's, it's really simple. It's just uh, to be being able to exchange services using time as currency. So, um, and, th and that's uh, what the Time Bank Open Free Software Project is about. And you don't even you don't need to to think that this this is going to to be uh, another currency. You are not uh, instead of using money using time, but it's, uh, it's just a way to uh, dynamize the, the, the way an, an organization works. You use time so that everyone can contribute to, to the community equally. Um, and it, this can, can be used not only for social services, but uh, for any kind of organization. For example, we are going to use the, this software in in our local, un local Linux user group in Seville, where I come from. And the thing is that for social services, the idea, main idea was that lots of people don't have lots of money, but they have time, and a lot of time in their hands. And they, they know how to do, how to do things. They, they know, for example, they can provide service a lot of a lot of services. For example, they can help you with your cooking if you are not very good, a very good cooker like me, <laughs> or if you are a computer, a computer person, you can help them with the, the with the computer, or you can fix the the, your, the bike if it is, is not working, <laughs> or even uh, you can exchange the time for trans transport, okay? Not a taxi where you pay money, where you pay money for the transport, but just exchange time. One people, one person can uh, give you a ride and another will maybe give you uh, some classes of cooking and then you will fix the computer of another person. So this, uh, this is working for local communities of people who work together and know each other. This is the main, the main idea. And some data, well, there are more than 100 active time banks in UK, uh, 53 officially recognized time bank in the USA. As I said earlier, uh, there, this idea came back from the 80s, and now that we are in the economic like, crisis, crisis uh, is coming back. And a bit about the project, the software project. Well, this is the, the main page of a uh, time bank using uh, uh, the software we've developed. It just lists, lists the services, some news. It's like, actually, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's a social web page. And a bit about the, about the technical details, well, it's written in Django, in Python. Python. It's, it, well, it supports localization. It's translated to Spanish and English 
and actually also to a Spanish with a neutral gender. Uh, for that base, migrations, we suppose south, we use south, and it's, it's been tested with SQLite and Postgres, and for dependencies, for installing the dependencies of this software, we use VirtualEnv. Uh, for those who use Django or Python, might know what was that. Um, our idea is that it must be easy to use and deploy, easy to use because uh, the people working, well, the people that mm, you can use the, the software are, are maybe they're old, Typically, they are old because in social services, there are lots of uh, lot of the people in these communities are old and they, they are not compute, computer wise, um, and it needs to be easy, really easy to use. But also, if you have uh, a small organization, you typically don't don't have a computer person that can help with the with the software. So. It needs to be really easy to deploy. Um, for doing that, we we use uh, we, well we, we use the technology I mentioned earlier. And the status of the project is that uh, in January last last month we released the first version. And this week, this week we have released the next version 1.1, and it's completely functional. And well, we have already two organizations in in the south of Spain using the software. Uh, many more are coming because uh, there are lots of interest with having a software that works. Because there are other projects that that ha that provide uh, time banking, but they they are either not well known or old and not really working, and we want to have a good community. We have a mail list, user list, wiki, track. We use JIT for development. And well, uh, because as I said, uh, pr organizations, they don't know a lot about uh, computers either. We provide the, uh, the service to create your own time bank, just like you can create your own WordPress. Well, you can create your own time bank, but as we have in Guadobo, my, my company, we have le, that we are we are developing this over in, in Guadobo. Uh, we have uh, limited resources. Because of that, we only pro can provide the the free service to some non-profit organizations. But if you want, you can request your own time bank, and we'll we will study your case, or you, of course you can download the code and install you, it in your servers. And we will, if you ask, ask, ask us in the mail list, we can help your, your problems. Of course, for more, ser more services like custom developments and hosting and deployment and support for a bit of money, we can, we can give you all these kind of services. Uh, future development, we, have, we, are, we are thinking about adding plugin support so it's, it's easier to extend the, the, the software. And for example, uh, one idea is, that to, is to create uh, time banks only for transport. That's one of our, our ideas. And then if there are lots of, more of ideas that are coming, so we might develop it. Uh, I'm going to do a bit of a demo if possible, uh, and I'm going to use the, the, the demo time bank that we have in our servers. This is the web page, and I have, for example, I'm going to show the admin user. I'll log in here. Well, it's in Spanish, I'm going to put it in English. Okay, so here we see a uh, photo of me, <laughs> and the list of services. I, I, the, I, at this moment, there's only one service in, in this demo server. And because I'm an administrator, I have more tabs like this one. Here I can see all the people that are in this server. And I can locate all the people. Click, click here and see the, the profile all the information, I can write a, 
a message to this person if you want. And of course, view his services, but he's not providing anyone. So, for example, if I want to create a new service, I click in here in service, services, and create a new service. And then I, I oops, here is not this one is not translated, <laughs> and and I can create the, a new service. For example, I, I can help you uh, with your cooking, but not well with your cooking. And I can choose a category because the, there are categories for for the services, but uh, in the, the server I have only one. The area, you might have uh, multiple areas. If you have an organization that is bigger and is in a city, for, you, you could provide only your service to one part of the city if you don't want to move. And it could be either an offer or a demand. So my service is already created, and now I have these two services. Now, for example, in another, in another browser, I can list the services here and request, well, send a message to this person that is offering a, ser a service and talk with him to say, okay, what kind of cooking do you know? When can we meet? Everything, send a message here. When can we meet? So it's kind of really, we're trying to, to make it really easy to use. And now if I, I go to the other browser, where is the admin, the admin <coughs> user log it, locked, uh, and I click anywhere, and now I have, one, I have one message, okay? And then finally I might, I might uh, finally request a service. Well, this one is in Spanish also. I finally can request, request the, the service. Uh, send previous matches. It's a demand. Oh, here. It cancel transfer services. Oh, which, what happened here? Request transfer here. So you have a service and you request a transfer of hours, of time to this, this person. Hello? May you teach me how to do an omelette? <laughs> I don't know. For example, I select how many time it might take. Request transfers, and the transfer is request. So, uh, I get I, I will get an email for this as uh, the, the the person offering the service and a key for example in transfers I will see the this new transfer coming and I can accept it oops they haven't done I don't know oh uh, there is a bug here I don't know what was happening but <laughs> Uh, this is a demo, the, the demo problem always. <laughs> but as you can see, it's really, really easy to use, the interface. And, and well, the, I can show you a bit of how, how this works internally. Well, you, I have downloaded the software here. And it, have, it has an install document. And it, it, it's really easy to install. You just need Python, and then execute this command here, setup env. It downloads all the dependencies locally in, the, in this directory. Then you can use this to, to use the, you execute this command, source env bin activate to, to get those dependencies working, and then install the database load the, the sample data, and then run the server. Of course, 
if you see the, the documentation in Django, you can see how to use this in Apache or any a Cherokee. We've been using all kinds of servers and it works fine, it's Django. And you can configure uh, email updates, so the, if there is a new transfer coming or, new, or people are offering, offering services, you can configure uh, so, the, so that the users get email updates via uh, periodically, and so they they, they want they won't uh, forget that there is a transfer. They will get the email later. I think that's that's my time. If you got uh, any fast questions, we can meet Eduardo uh, later, here, or you will yeah. be here later as well talking. Uh, so we'll be, be around for the next couple of okay. hours. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So thank you for coming. Thank you very much.